which one particularly from this three we should use to win lottery so uh, is there any sequence that uh, like first we should use uh, law of abundance then manifestation then law of attraction is there any sequence or we need to use all these three uh, all together the sequence is to start begin to appreciate however mm-hmm. however it's not always easy for people to start with that what i say and what the way i i teach the program is to have fun and to do the thing that's easy first because when you do the thing that's easy the part mm-hmm. that comes easily to you then what are you going to do you're going to do it more right and the more you do it the more you feel the result and then the more you feel the result what are you going to do you're going to get excited and then you're going to do it more and then you're going to try other things so the yeah. first step is you know either focus on appreciation or focus on just being present and looking around and seeing the abundance that exists right begin with one of these things that these these aspects which feel seem to be easy to you okay. okay if none of them are easy then start to read or look at videos which are telling you nice things which are supporting you positive affirmations videos which are sharing positive thoughts look at animals or look at uh, wildlife videos go out in nature and start to just look around and feel how you feel because the first thing to do in manifestation is to improve the emotions that you have you must improve how you feel yeah. you can only get good from good feeling emotions and uh, which silva method technique uh, helps us to you know go uh, in much depth level or deeper level of manifestation law of attraction and law of abundance well the first thing to do is meditate and jose silva's system is is exceptionally simple and the meditation is to it's a very simple and easy to learn technique that will take you to relaxation to the state of meditation to the state of alpha and in that state you automatically feel the peace you feel the peace of the higher intelligence around you you feel the peace of the beauty of the world and that's the first place you want to go absolutely essential because stress is something we all have and we're we're dealing with and as jose silva reminds us that we need to reduce the resistance to the things around us that we want and the way you do that is meditate whether it's using the jose silva system or the silva method or whether it's mindfulness meditation which is really a being present to what is taking place and you know any meditation technique will help you to feel that peace okay 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 perfect so uh, so that we learned is like uh, to win lottery the first step should be practice mindfulness or practice meditation any kind of meditation whatever like makes a person more calm and relaxed so that uh, you know uh, the person can control of uh, has like control over his thought processes or has control over everything so that he can start you know uh showing the gratitudes and then like uh, manifest the proper goal and uh, like attract the things that he actually looking for so i believe this is a then first step uh, to win lottery okay. so uh, what's next what's next uh, davos what um, the next thing that people should do the next thing you should do is one of the techniques we teach in the silva method is called the mental house cleaning so you want to get clear of the thoughts that are keeping you from winning winning something okay for instance debelina if i ask you are you a lucky person what would you say yes definitely you feel lucky okay the majority of people will say no i'm not lucky okay so let's start thinking lucky in order to have that manifest in your life you need to believe that you're going to get it. So, 
the mental house cleaning technique, that is getting clear of some of the negative thoughts that are limiting you, erasing them, canceling them from your mind, and then replacing them with better feeling positive thoughts in the direction that you want to go will support you in creating that positive thought pattern. Okay, 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 perfect. So uh, the next step is mental house cleaning to, uh, you know, uh, to do the, uh, to like bring the positive thought patterns in our mind. So uh, Stephen, is the same thing that we will, uh, we can use to win other prizes as well, like not only lottery, but also like, you know, the racetrack baits and uh, all other things as well. Uh, can we use the same process? Absolutely. It's the same process, whether you want to win money, whether you want to have a new relationship, whether you mm -hmm. want to manifest the job, a different job and a house mm -hmm. and so forth. Okay. Okay. So like uh, one more question that I'm having is like, uh, for example, for a single lottery, okay, I'm also manifesting and following the Selva method techniques and everything, whatever, uh, like we will learn in throughout this conversation. And for the same particular lottery, uh, some other people is also doing the same things. They are also uh, manifesting. They are also, you know, uh, like uh, they are also showing their gratitudes. They are also doing the mental house campaign. They are also like uh, bringing more and more positive energies uh, into their lives. So uh, how we can like ensure them that, yeah, we are only going to, you know, get this lottery. <laughs> I know this is a bit silly question, but you know, this thing is like, I am getting this in my mind. So thought of yeah, no, that's absolutely, it's a, it's a, it's the perfect question, right? Because, um, it comes to the point of, well, now I have, when you're thinking that, oh, other people are doing it. So there's not enough for me. Then I've mm -hmm. lost my step one, which is abundance. Okay. So you want okay. to stay inside. There is enough. There are so many lotteries out there. Like if you really look at the world, there are so many lotteries if that's what you want to do. Okay. There are so mm -hmm. many prizes. So one of the, one of the women who is an instructor, uh, is an instructor candidate with, uh, in Canada, she is the one who is taking over Helene Hatzel's, um, books. So she's going to be publishing Helene Hatzel's books. Helene Hatzel was mm -hmm. the contest queen. She was the woman that Jose Silva worked with who, uh, was manifesting. Basically, she won prizes all her life. Okay. Yes. And she taught other people to do that. And uh, Carolyn Willman, who is uh, here in Canada, she does the same thing, but she does it on the Canadian level. And she has won, and I'm, I don't remember, but 38 different prizes. She's won um, something like, I don't know, 15 trips. She's won numerous things. And her attitude, uh, just after one of the last Silva courses she was on, is she said she went home, she read a book about winning a cruise. She goes, I've never been on a cruise. Oh, that's really interesting. I'd like to, I think I'm going to win a cruise now. And then the next day she receives a telephone call. So yeah. her friend calls her up and says, hey, Carolyn, guess what? I just want a cruise and uh, my husband doesn't want to go with me. He doesn't have time now. So do you want to come? What do you wow. think she said? Of course. That's it, yeah. So this is the first time that she started uh, getting the law of attraction or manifestation works for her, her. No, she's been winning prizes all her life. This is, oh, this wow. is, this is her hobby winning prizes. Oh. Wow. That's great. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. And also like for Helen Hansel, uh, we have an amazing audio, uh, like vlog that we have published in Silva international site. So I'll put the uh, link of this mm. as well in the description box so that people can go and uh, check it out. Uh, it's in Silva method official YouTube channel. So uh, it's, uh, she is an interesting mm. you know, person. I have read her story and, uh, it's, it's quite, you know, amazing and interesting.